Hello guys, my name is Diana, welcome to my channel. So this is my segment for lookbooks and today we're going to be looking at a particular brand because they are a little bit special. It's called Washington Ave and they basically specialize in reworked vintage clothing items. So we're gonna look at a few of their pieces and yeah, let's talk about it. Let's get into it. Okay, so the first look is, I guess, something in their current collection. I feel like with the pieces that Washington Avenue provides, it's one of those things where you're not gonna find many of it, okay? So it is one piece of clothing that has been reworked and changed into something a little bit more fresher and new. It might have like an old flair to it before, but now it's given it a new flair. So. This is one of the looks that they have on their stores and it's this really, really cute sort of wrap around top. These tops are really in right now and at this point I don't even know whether they're actually tops or just a scarf that you can just wrap around and create this look. But all in all it's such a cute look, it's really great for summer that is upcoming. This would be perfect with a pair of trousers. If you don't want to go overly sort of pattern with it, you can pair this with just plain trousers. But she's paired it with the rework shorts as well and it's got pockets, fantastic. This is such a really cute spring summer look and it's very fresh, it's very darling, it's very cute and yeah, I love this piece from them. The second look here is very, very vintage. Now, I don't think this one has been reworked, more like sourced perhaps. And it's this color block blazer. It's this color block suit jacket and it's given me, oh my God, like Fresh Prince of Bel-Air. It's given me that vibe. It looks like one of the characters possibly. Not so much Hillary. She used to wear like one piece, one colored suits, but maybe some other character. It looks very fun, it looks very vibrant, and it's just so precious, it's really cute. It is taking you to a certain time within that period in the 90s, definitely. But yeah, I love this vintage piece. You have to be brave in order to wear sort of color block with this much color. Whoever dares, whoever dares. I love this piece because it is, something that has been reworked but it has been changed into maybe a really timeless piece first of all i love the pattern in it it's not too crazy the color palette is really really tasteful i love this sort of lilac -y color within this two piece and i love the the puff sleeves on this top it is so cute and it's so nice it's something that i'd wear within a heartbeat maybe i should just like give my mother this idea and make her make me one. <laughs> I might have to do that. She's done a really stunning work. I think this is classic, classic look. Another classic look I would say is this two piece pink top and skirt. This has been reworked as well. And it is so cute. You know, the end, the, the sort of shoulders is giving you very vintage, very old school. The material is giving you that same era that same vibe however we have gone a little bit modern a little bit current with it with the tie up and then the slip skirt you know the slip skirts are very in right now so perhaps this was like a one piece dress that has been reworked into two pieces so to make it a slip dress is very in so top shop is selling their slip dress for lord knows how much and you have simply made one right here just by cutting a dress into two and creating two pieces. Absolutely gorgeous. It's really looking timeless here. This is something that you can certainly have in your closet for a very long time. This next reworked piece, absolutely stunning. I'm not too sure how it's been reworked. Perhaps it was like one gigantic suit jacket. I don't know, but it's a two piece now. Perhaps they added the little cinching in the waist of the skirt. I don't know what, what part has been reworked, but I absolutely love, love this. It's a vibrant lime green, very in right now. And it's something that has been reworked to fit the time. Such a brilliant job, well done, I must say. I love how long sleeve the top is, but it's also cropped, you know, giving you that very fresh youthful look and then we've got the high-waisted skirt absolutely gorgeous have beautiful models as well very very beautiful so you guys might recognize this sort of knitted jumper from the likes of 
Biggie. I think it's the brand Kooji, but it's that brand. And this was basically inspired by that. It is basically taking something that comes straight out of the 90s and making it very, very fresh, very, very new. And that being a crop top and skirt or a crop top and shorts. I love this piece so much. It is definitely taken from that jumper that Biggie was wearing and making it something a little bit feminine, a little bit flattering for a woman to wear. And yeah, she has made this look really fun. This next look is a mud cloth fabric and it's really given me something like a Ghanaian Adinkra vibe, you know, something that we will tie dye. Um, not necessarily tie dye, but in Ghana, we use like foam to print wax patterns onto the cloth and then dye it and then get the wax off. My mum used to do something like that. That's why I'm aware of it. This is giving me that vibe and I absolutely love the fabric to start off with because it does give me that nostalgia look and um, that's what I sort of grew up with. But I love what she's done with it in terms of styling and sewing this piece. Brilliant, absolutely brilliant. It's a really, really cute piece. Very fun, very young, very youthful. Absolutely stunning. This is very much Texas cowgirl. Okay, so this is for me something I would only wear like a, at a festival or something, or I don't know, some sort of event where it includes wearing a cowgirl look. That's the only time I would definitely wear this. I'm not too sure if this has been reworked or basically been created from scratch or been sourced. I'm not too sure what the ins and outs of this particular piece is but I do love that it is an overall look of cowgirl and something you can definitely wear to a festival if you wanted to have that vibe, you know. She looks stunning in terms of that. I love that. This is, they call it a vintage tie-dye piece. Love tie-dye. Again, my mum was really, really into tie-dye. I remember it in our back garden back in Ghana on the military camp. I love this piece. It's basically taking a tie-dye patterned dress and making it into something modern, which is these slip dress. You know these dresses, they come in like um, sort of the silky slip fabric. I'm not too sure what fabric this is, but it does look like it does take shape to the body very, very well. And I love this bag that she's holding. It is so, so cute. It's really nice. I love this. Last look. Hillary Banks, eat your heart out. This is definitely Hillary Banks, all right? This is something that Hillary Banks would wear in the Fresh Prince of Bel-Air. Absolutely stunning. We love this colors. The colors are really calling my name. It's very bright, it's very vibrant, very fun. What differs between these two suits? One is like a suit dress and one is like a suit and skirt. Absolutely stunning. I love the variation within these two. It's not something you really see often. You don't really see suit skirts up to that length, really. No, you don't. I feel like the last time I saw that was Fresh Prince, honestly. And that's the only time I've seen it. So it's nice to see this. I think it's something that we should definitely bring back. It is so, so cute. And that is the roundup of Washington Ave on Instagram. Go check them out. The pieces are so fun. I literally follow them because of the different pieces that comes out every now and then. It's so, so fun. I try to get inspiration from it. I hope you like this. Please like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.